What's up everybody and welcome to tips episode 3. Today we're going to cover how to build your own lib crew. It's going to be a more philosophical episode. We're not really going to cover mechanics or anything like that. I just felt like new players that don't already have their own consistent group of players or their own lib crew already need to know how to get started and how to like set themselves up for getting better over time and sort of slowly but steadily moving from you know being that random pilot or random gunner to having consistency like if you're a gunner you want you know to have that consistency at the pilot position so you can sort of get better together and vice versa if you're trying to learn how to pilot you want that consistency of oh I've got the same guy gunning for me most of the time and I'm getting better with that person over time slowly now on the subject of having random pilots or random gunners that's that's how a lot of people are going to be starting off and quite honestly if you're just brand new brand spanking new to the air game it's a decent way to get some experience I mean of course a lot of the times you're probably going to die in uh, 30 seconds to a minute but um, you know if you're desperate for some experience from some gunning experience or flying experience it's better than nothing and when I started to learn how to fly I, no one actually taught me how to fly um, I just picked up randoms at the warp gate like constantly and just pretty much focused on my fundamentals I just picked up any random that would get into my gunner seat and I would just try to focus on giving angles and my tank busting and ambushing fundamentals so over time I slowly but surely just increased my overall flying experience and experience with libs in general whether it was gunning or flying now as you're starting off and gaining experience as a random with other randoms as well usually add people to your friends list like you want to be social and also add people to your friends list that you know like libs and fly them at least a decent amount so you can keep on getting experience with the same people and you know one step further than this you want to find people that are like-minded you know if you're just flying for fun then you want to find people that are just flying for fun but um, if you want to be a little bit more hardcore and you want to get good and get better consistently over time then you want to find somebody eventually that has the same mindset as you and also plays at the same time as you do so if you're a pilot you know you have that gunner consistency and you just play together it's like <laughs> and uh, probably a lot as well but you, you just keep on playing together so much so that you you're just bound to get better and you know it's a funny random fact that like I I met Mustard Mania through just flying in a public platoon just asking for a gunner and he just happened to get in and I had a Dalton and I was like oh crap he can hit ESF so and you know and then we just started playing with each other and we generally liked each other from the start so we we just played a crap ton together so much so that we got decent at living somehow <laughs> so you know I think it's v it's a very underrated aspect that a lot of people don't look at like you you should find some people that you enjoy playing the game a lot with and just keep on playing keep on flying with them over and over and you'll get better through just that raw amount of experience especially if you're like-minded enough and you're both trying to get to that you know above average plus level then you'll sort of naturally constructively criticize each other and you know trim the fat so to speak and just naturally refine all of your little timings or techniques and eventually you'll get really good and that's the goal think that does it for this video you guys know what to do give me a like hit the subscribe button if you guys want to see more videos like this let me know what you guys want to see in the future in the comments um, you can always catch me on twitter as well my next tips video might be on something like map reading because i've been getting a lot of questions on what fights libs should be going into how to find your fight so it might be like a live map reading video but uh, we'll see. Let me know what you guys think about that idea. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.